I am so excited. So someone's laughing at me here saying I'm excited. I am, but I am super, super excited because look at you all. You are awesome. You're awesome. Like I, I just this is like so great to fill this room um, for the last last show of this show and the next show is gonna be full team. So um, um, thank you all for coming out um, and doing this and uh, it makes it so much more special. I mean if it's just Daniel and I sitting in the audience is special but for all of you it's more special so uh, really appreciate it and uh, we've been waiting for a long, almost a year to have these lucky girls here. Um, just a show of hands, how many of you were s set up or signed up for the show last year? I think a lot of you were. Yeah. Oh, yeah, so it sold out last year and uh, we've all waited for a long time. And here they are. And Jenny and I saw them yesterday at, uh, at the Red Bird, um, an afternoon show, and it was really super fun. So it's all well worth the wait. Paula, Holly, Bella, and Ellie. <laughs> Daniel and I were talking about you your name should have actually been on the magpies, but you should have had an L name because yes, you're all yeah. <laughs> Anyway, so um, yeah, help me welcome them all. Thank you so much. <laughs> a lot of new people here. There's two washrooms, most important thing. Two washrooms, so once you get out the door of the kitchen, there's a washroom right up there, or up the stairs and right across. And there's going to be two sets with the introduction of all the ladies that you brought, so we'll see you. Okay. <laughs>
little bit down here. And we stayed here last night, which was, which was super great for us, because then we got up today and then we haven't done anything. <laughs> <laughs> well, we, uh, we went for a walk down the road and we said, we'll go to that stop sign and then we'll come back. And we got to the stop sign and we thought, well, let's look at the map and see whether you can do a loop around. And we looked at the map and we thought, yeah, we'll, we'll go around the block. We'll be back in like half an hour. Canada <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah. is massive. <laughs> <laughs> I think we walked like nine and a half kilometers. <laughs> about two hours. <laughs> so we have done something today. Yeah. 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 We did a search party like this. problems, which is not great when you play the banjo. Um, can, I, can you all hear everything okay? Yes, it's okay. great. Fantastic. We've had a little bit of, uh, well, reconfiguration of the setup, so that's good. Good answer. <laughs> good news. <laughs> We're going to play you uh, an, an English traditional song. You might have noticed from our accent, so we're not from <laughs> Ontario. <laughs> we're from England. And uh, yeah, this is a traditional song. It's called I Never Will Marry. Which, coincidentally, it's a band motto. <laughs>
been here a while now, haven't we? Not at this house. Um, we've been in Canada for uh, coming on three weeks. And, uh, we've loved it. Yeah, it's been great. Um, there's some things which I really like about Canada. Uh, I'm going to list them all. Uh, whilst I tune. <laughs> no, not really. I really like all of it, um, to be honest. It's great, much better than England, but don't tell. <laughs> yeah, really. Yeah. The thing with house concerts is that you get too relaxed and then you don't think it is. But we have been disappointed. Everywhere we go, we've been telling uh, the audiences that we really want to see a moose. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, everywhere we go, they say. And yeah, they just they come back and they say, you don't want to see a moose. <laughs> At least not in your windscreen. No. <laughs> but also, that's not the answer to the question. Yeah, and also, the question is, will we see a moose? <laughs> just to be clear, like, you don't want to kill a moose. I feel like people think that's what we're here to do. <laughs> 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 um, Free vegetarians, but I just want to hunt that moose. <laughs> Um, I'm going to sing you uh, one of my songs, it's called No More Tears, and um, it's a breakup song, which I know is very sad, <laughs> <laughs> um, but to be fair, I hadn't broken up with anyone when I wrote it, I just uh, thought it was better to be prepared. <laughs> <laughs> it's called a chorus, would you, would you like to sing it with us? Yeah. Yeah. I'll teach it to you, because <laughs> No more tears.
ourselves as being, being pretty lucky that we get to, to do what we do, uh, travelling around to wonderful places like Russell. <laughs> <laughs> And, uh, and yeah, and getting to, to, to see the world and to yeah, play our, our music and, and it's, yeah, it's pretty great. And stay with wonderful people and meet lots of wonderful people. But every now and then, when we've accidentally walked 10 kilometers. <laughs> 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 Take double them. <laughs> <laughs> but that's okay because I know that the tune is everyone's favourite bit. <laughs> Why don't they sound check? This one's called All Night.
Um, so we're just going to do one, one more song now and then we're going to have a little um, in intermission. The song's called uh, Undercar and it's the name of um, our most recent album. on our lengthy walk earlier, weren't we? Mm. So it was uh, spices invented because it's um, it was to get the drug into prisons because it's synthetic and it didn't smell. Uh, and it's a cannabis. But I guess you guys don't necessarily have that problem. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <not that. laughs>
Lost in all things nice, lost in the undertow. Thank you. 
album, which is called, um, the album's called Tidings, which is the, one of the collective nouns for a group of magpies. <laughs> 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 there's, a, there's lots of them, aren't there? Quite fun, fun ones. A mischief. A mischief of most tires, yeah. Mm. Mm. Can't remember. Michael? Mm. Okay. Oh, no. That's geese. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, for those of you who don't know, you, you have my prize in these parts, don't you? No. no. Yeah. 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 We have lots of my prize. But yeah, it has caused some confusion. I didn't. I, did, I thought they were, you know, I thought they were everywhere. My class, but they're not. And uh, my friend from America, she's a very polite girl, and for and she's known me a long time. And the whole time, she thought that uh, the band was named after a type of pine. <laughs> Oh, oh, oh. 
We're going to sing you another traditional song now. Would you like to sing it with us? Sure. Sure. <laughs> Maybe. Um, this is a song that's written from the perspective of a, of a man. And uh, I know it is because he spends a whole song moaning. <laughs> 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 Fancies this lass. And um, she don't fancy him. And uh, yeah, then you wrote something about it. And here we are. <laughs> Sing it. Uh, I'll teach it to you. Here goes. I'm falling on my knees. I'm begging you, please. Can you try? I'm falling on my knees. I'm begging you. That was, that was very, very good. <laughs> <laughs> so it's just a reminder that um, who was it who thought what they thought the lyrics were? Oh yeah, we we uh, we did a gig in, in Newcastle uh, back at home a few months ago, and someone afterwards came up and said uh, they were kind of confused by the lyrics. Um, why would the man have fallen on his knees? <laughs> <laughs> So I'm falling on my knees. I'm begging you, please. Won't you come and stand by me, little girl? Try that. Won't you come and stand by me? He's <laughs> getting uh, dicier all the time. <laughs> uh, that's all right. if, you, um, if you wouldn't mind being a bit more British, and yeah. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> Ew. Yeah, I'm Would people prefer to hear the guitar or the voice? <laughs> the voice. I can the voice. The voice. The voice. The voice. Sure. Yeah. <laughs>
Um, so I think we're, we're coming towards the end of our evening with you tonight. And uh, we've just had a really wonderful time. Um, can we just have a, a massive thank you for Kitty and Daniel for helping us out? Yeah.
Tradition.
Super, super fun, like amazing talent, and um, uh, I think uh, um, for some of you who maybe don't know, I mean, Mia, Ke Mia Kelly, we saw her live just recently, and she blew us away. She's incredible, and she's this young whippersnipper, and uh, I mean, they're all like amazing talent, but anyway, so it's probably, it's probably like three quarters sold out already, so if you're wanting to come, make sure you get your name down with us, and because it, it will sell out for sure. And it is on December 9th. It's a Saturday afternoon, so it's an afternoon show, so it can spread out um, through the day. And it'll be a Christmas show. There'll be some Christmas stuff. There'll be not so much Christmassy stuff. But anyways, you're all very welcome. And uh, I don't know, anything else, Dan? Am I forgetting something? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you all. Thank you all. Thank you. 